My name is Ignacio Rellana. I am the drummer of Pyrosaint. Uh, we are currently promoting our album Infected Brutality. But also we're going to be talking about uh, our new members. So sit tight. This is Army of One TV. Uh, Pyrosen was formed in 1989, Santiago, Chile. I joined the band um, in 1990. Uh, we recorded two demos in one EP uh, down in Chile. And we also play a lot of gigs and stuff uh, inside of Santiago and outside of Santiago. Todo nació el año 1989, eh, cuando éramos estudiantes, ¿cierto? Teníamos aproximadamente 16 años, todo, ¿cierto? Hicimos un grupo, un grupo de amigos, ¿cierto? Y nos, nos dedicamos a componer ciertas canciones. Siempre, siempre estábamos con, con la problemática de los, de los integrantes, que, que algunos fallaban, no llegaban a los ensayos. Y, y a uno de esos ensayos llegó Ignacio Orellana. Ignacio llegó a un, a un ensayo de, eh, solamente a ver, a, a ver el ensayo. Y como tenía ciertos estudios de, de percusión, parchó en ese minuto al, al baterista, en el, que en ese minuto creo que era Keiko, no, no recuerdo el nombre, pero era, era, era Keiko, él no llegó, llegó Nacho y, y después no, no salió más, hasta, hasta el día de hoy. A funny story about the band, of, or the beginning of the band, is the way I joined the band. Uh, a friend of mine called Keiko, he called me up, he said, hey dude, come with me, and uh, I have a, a call from these guys who want me to try as a drummer. And uh, I don't want to be by myself, so why don't you come and join me? So I said to him, okay, no problem, I'll, I'll meet you there. And I went there, my friend never showed up. And I, I went to the building and these guys were playing. And I walked in the room and it was Tukan who was playing drums. And that's when um, uh, they, that was the first rehearsal of Pyro Saint that was in 1989 and so. So I played with them the whole rehearsal, but they called me back in a year after. So there you go, that's when I find a story about the way I joined the band. So the band uh, reformed in 2011 here in New York. Uh, Ron Wagner, a bass player, joined me and we started looking for a guitar player. So we tried a couple guys and uh, finally we got to Bill Smith, which has been with us since then. We are currently recording uh, a full-length album. Hey, it's Ronnie from Pyrosaint. We're up here in upstate New York, where you can see it's a little cold out here. Answer to Ed for a down fire, looking for a bass player. Um, turned out I met Notch, the drummer from down fire, through down fire. Uh, we did a short stint with them. We did a nice little tour with Ronnie Monroe from Metal Church. Played four or five gigs up here. That was cool. Uh, after that, we decided we wanted to go in a different vein. Notch wanted to go in a different way. So I was on board with him. That's how we ended up with Pyro Saint. And we've been recording Pyro Saint stuff here at uh, Oily Sound Studios and sending the uh, tracks down to uh, Tucan in Chile. It's been uh, a slow process, but and we really like the way it's going, the way it's working out. When we first started this Pyro Saint thing, when I came on board with Notch with Pyro Saint, um, I'm a bass player that was playing with my fingers, and the uh, the metal rhythmic thrash side of it with the fingers on the bass just wasn't cutting through. So uh, Notch uh, he uh, suggested I pick up a pick and start playing the bass with the pick, which was a uh, a learning process for me because I hadn't played with a pick. Uh, it took me a good six to seven months to get get used to it, but it's been um, a welcoming adjustment for me. I really I really dig it the way it's sounding. Um, it's cutting through really good. How are we doing? This is Bill from Pyro Saint. I met Nacho 
uh, when he when he filled in for our drummer Kenny and uh, my other band Sacred Oath. Uh, we played a f we played three shows uh, on that on that mini tour, and uh, that's how I met him. He asked me afterwards uh, about a month or two later if I wanted to join the band uh, Pyro Saint and play guitar. So you know Sacred Oath was uh, on a little break at that point, so I was like, sure, yeah. So came came around and. Uh, yeah, the rest is history, here I am. This is different from Sacred Oath because uh, it's got a little more of an aggressive, more, you know, kind of a grittier, thrashier edge to it. And, uh, you know, borderline death metal as well. And that, that was a little different. And in this case, I'm the only guitarist. So it's just, uh, it's, it's all about learning to, you know, make yourself as big as possible and just round out the sound a little more uh, as the sole guitarist, so I kind of learned that way, and I'd say that's the biggest difference from Sacred Oath, where we have a lot the twin guitar harmony thing going on quite often. We record here in, uh, you know, the New York area. Yes, yeah, so then we'll send it, send the tracks down to Tucan, and he'll, he'll uh, lay down his vocals, and uh, we've got Ignacio doing the uh, mixing and stuff, and you know, he's doing a great job, as he gets, uh, he gets he definitely brings about the Pyro Saint sound. You know, we're, uh, you know, we definitely have a big sound for, you know, instrumentally being a three-piece and having one vocalist. So he gets a big sound out of us. It's good stuff. The stuff we're doing today, it's, I'd say it's a little more of like a thrash groove edge. Um, you know, we still try and stay true to the uh, original stuff. You know, we want to keep the integrity of the band and all that, but we just want to, we're, we're, you know, obviously with different musicians, it's gonna sound different. Uh, for, you know, so it'll uh, it'll definitely have a different sound. But we're just gonna we're gonna keep that Pyrocene edge and just uh, keep kicking ass. 2014 is the year of the Pyrocene. You watch out. When we were trying to get a singer around this area in New York, uh, we did a couple gigs. But the two times that we, we went to play, we, I mean, the two times we had the, the, the gigs booked, the singer didn't show up. So we ended up playing instrumental. And uh, even though we played the three piece band, people kind of liked it. So that's why we, we kept doing it. And as it is right now, we are almost finishing the album. Try to find us on pyrosaint.com or Facebook on facebook.com slash Pyro Saint. So hopefully you you get to hear our new music soon. We already have a couple singles out, uh, so you can find them on our websites. You can also go to iTunes and hope to see you soon in, in a show. Uh, next year probably we're gonna try to to do it. Okay, so rock it out, turn it up, and go Pyro Saint. Ask the question again, please. <laughs> <laughs>